Hey my blessed naturals, welcome back to my channel. I know it's been a while since I made a video. Um, it's been like, I think two, almost two months since I did my second big chop. And my hair is already starting to grow back some, but I'm still trying to decide if I want to cut it again or let it grow out because right now it's just, it's just more convenient for me to have my hair short. But I will keep you guys updated on that. Um, what else? Oh yeah. Um, so today I'm going to show you all how to do sponge, cur sponge curls or sponge coils. Um, the only thing that I'm using really is water. So I have a spray bottle with water in it. I'm also using this Eco Styler Gel. And I'm using a sponge. Now my sponge does have the scrubby part on it and I'm not going to use that on my hair but this was all I had. But I would suggest that if you try this style you use a sponge, a regular sponge. So, right now, you first thing you want to do is just wet your hair. So I'm just going to spritz my hair all around. Now, this spot style for me works better if I um, detangle my hair. So it's already been detangled. So I'm just, just spray water on it again. So you're going to take a little bit of gel. And you want to take it and start putting it like on sections of your hair, like just putting a little bit on it all over. I'm just going to take a little bit more. And then you want to, of course, wet your sponge. And then you want to take a large amount, maybe about this much for me. And just put it on the sponge. And then you want to take the sponge and just start to um, create like circular motions for your hair. And you'll start to see your hair curl. And you'll start to see, like I said, you'll start to see the curl, the hair kind of section off into curls or little co big coils or whatever hope you all can see my results from the, doing this. Well, you can see the curls. Now you might have to add like a little bit more gel and you know sponge it again, sponge it a little bit more. Um, I noticed of course like the longer your hair gets, it kind of like doesn't curl as faster, but you can do this like if you just did your big chop and your hair is about maybe like an inch or in, an inch to two inches, um, I find that it works on your hair. Um, if not, if you have the time, you can always use the comb or do finger coils. Um, if you visit oneblessnatural.com, I'll basically show you how to, um, you know, what I do 
to get finger coils but um yeah i wouldn't suggest doing this style every day or i only do this maybe like two two to three times a month because there's a lot of friction between your hair and the sponge that can cause um breakage so you want to kind of avoid that but this is a good thing to do if you just want a quick little style and just to get curls or get little coils or whatever um, quick without having to spend a whole lot of time in here this is a great method so um, yeah so sponge curls <laughs> so I will keep you all posted um, you all can let me know if you've tried this style and what were your results or just um, kind of like tag me in your videos or whatever um, but thank you all for watching um, don't forget to visit Ruthie, my, I have a, a greeting card business called Ruthie's Greeting, so I'm going to leave the information below and also um, at the end of this video. And thank you all for watching. Don't forget to visit OneBlessNatural.com. Bye.